Good morning, Ridge, and welcome back to another edition of Ridge Rush. I'm Adriana. And I'm Isabella. Here's what's happening around the Ridge and in the world on September 6, 2022. In sports news, the varsity volleyball team rallied from two sets to defeat Milton yesterday in five sets. In cross country, both the girls and boys team finished in second place in their meet yesterday. Great job, Lions. Multiple people, including at least five children, were injured after the high rise swing at the fair in northern India after a malfunction malfunction and plummeted 50 feet to the ground. The horrific moment, which was caught on camera, occurred Sunday around 9.15 in the city of Mali. A video of the accident shows the high-rise swing rise slamming into the ground, causing 16 people to fly out their seats. The attraction was supposed to close on the 31st, but was recently extended in, until September 11. The cause of this still remains unclear at this time. The Gwinnett County Police Department Homicide Unit is investigating after a man's body was found in the front yard of his home on Ridge Oak Drive around 10 a.m. in Suwannee on Monday. They've identified the man as 40-year-old Matthew Jones after police responded to a person down call. Police said the man suffered from an apparent stab wound and as, as of right now, they have no motives or suspects in the case. Now here's Adriana with the weather. Today we'll see a high of 86 and a low of 69 with a 40% chance of rain later today. Well, that's all the news we have for you today. I'm Adriana. And I'm Isabella. Have a great day, Ridge. And, and go, go Lions! Lions.